All right, I'm gonna go over the bench press and most of the time we're working out by ourselves. So we don't have a spotter. So I'm gonna go over dumbbell bench press, okay? But if you'd like to use the barbell, just, it's, it's awesome first of all to have a spotter. Second of all, if you don't, put up the catches and just make sure your feet are firmly pressed into the ground. I'm short, I'm four foot 11. I don't find it great to set up on a bench because my feet float. And then I have to sit up, bring plates over so that my feet are flat. Honestly, stepper all the way. Cause I can set the height to make sure my feet are firmly pressed on the ground. And that way I can get a little bit of power. Um, so they say it's okay to arch your back a little bit when you're doing the bench press. You can still use heavy dumbbells and bench press by yourself. That's why I love using the stepper. So I'm gonna show you how to set up here um, and I will show you some safety precautions as well. So I have 20s here. All right, so you're gonna get on the bench, okay? You can put the weight on your knees till you get your feet at the end of the bench, okay? Then you can slowly lower. All right, now I want you to be able to see here. So I'm gonna have a slight arch in my back and I'm gonna press. One, four, three, two, one, one, two. 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 Now the nice thing is, drop them. If you're starting to lose power and can't quite get it up, drop them and you're safe. So same as the squat, on the downward motion is where you're being challenged. That's the eccentric part of the exercise. So you're gonna go down nice, slow and control. Four, three, two, one. One, two for the press. Sorry, I'm a little out of breath. I love lifting heavy, woo! 